What's up everyone, XM and Albert here. Welcome to another Skate 3. For this video, I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to be, what the fuzzy? How to be um, decent, okay? And how to be good at Skate 3 for the most popular maps. And I'm only gonna be showing you the ditch and the mega park for this video, okay? If you guys like this series, make sure you thumbs up the button. And also make sure you let me know what other locations you want me to do in the comment section down below this video after we are complete. So for this location, we're gonna be at the ditch so uh, let me go back to the top which is i believe the observatory i can't really pronounce that first of all i want to give a huge shout out to mighty gaming 235 if you guys want to check him out his link will be in the description down below this video check him out after my vid is complete oh god look at him run run forest run oh my god i don't know what the fuzzy he's running from but he is running Damn, son. I never seen a fat man run that fast before. I don't know what kind of accent that was, but anyways. So, the ditch. The ditch is one of the most popular maps. In my opinion, it is the second most popular map in Skate 3. Um, first popular map is Mega Park, of course. The ditch is pretty awesome, okay? This is a good uh, spot for trick liners and a good spot for competitive. But guessing that you guys want to learn how to get, you know, pretty decent score when you're online on spot battle. Oh, I thought I didn't put a freaking marker. Online on spot battle, going against your friends, or you're trying to impress them with a nice score. You know, it's all about score when you're playing spot battle on, on these kinds of maps and whatnot. So I'm gonna be teaching you, you know, how to get decent score on uh the ditch and mega park okay keep in mind i'm not going to teach you to be an extreme 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 professional at this game i'm just going to teach you how to basically get decent score okay so don't be freaking out in the comment section below be like oh my god albert that is not the best way to get points relax okay relax it's a seven year old game we're not trying to freaking no life skate three right now anyways so when it's your turn you usually spawn right here right I don't know if you guys notice, I'm pretty sure a lot of you have, especially if you watched me for a while, but I have two different runs, okay? I have two, two different runs. And no, they're not runs that I made up, it's just runs that I feel comfortable with and I just do it, okay? So anyway, oh my god. Stay in your spot, girl! There you go. Place the marker, okay. So here we go, three, two, one, go. First up, I go like this, and then I go like this, and then... Bam. So basically the key right here is to do a 540 tower. Okay, you don't need to do this other fancy trick like I just did the freaking uh, hard flip You can literally oh My god girl come on. You can literally push X jump. Oh wait push X Ollie tail walk spin bam and land the tail walk. That's it. So push Ollie spin tail walk bam once again push Ollie tail walk spin bam That's it Look how many points you get, 2.2 something thousand. That's already a great start, okay? That's literally already a great start. I see some people go like this sometimes, they get off the board and they jump like this, and then if you do it too much, that happens. You freaking fall, right? Okay. Also, I see other people going this way. This way, I don't know why you're going that way, so just don't do that, okay? There's a really good chance you're gonna freaking hit this freaking thing right there. Yeah, don't, don't do that. Literally, do not go anywhere besides pushing X, going a little bit to the left, Spinning, doing a tail. That's it. That's all you gotta do. It's so easy. Okay, I'm gonna do it on the on freaking face cam. Here we go. Watch. Push, Ollie, spin the tail walk. That's it. It's so easy. Easy. If you don't know how to do those tricks, practice some individually. Okay. First, practice. You should know how to push. I mean, who the who doesn't know how to push? Uh, practice the Ollie. So it's straight down and then flick it straight up. Straight down, straight up. Bam. Okay. Easy as one, two, three. After that, tra practice the air walk. I mean the air walk, the tail walk. So it's basically round the stick up, B, and then LT. You gotta press it like this simultaneously and then hold it. Okay, that's how you do a tail walk. Bam, 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 and that's it. Bam, make sure you land straight and then you, there you go, okay? There you go. Next one, if that's a little bit too difficult for you, well, this one is another one that I like to do. I get off my board and I run this way and as soon as I'm up right here, I push, ollie, tail walk, bam. Another tail walk 540, and then I cut right into here. That one did seem a little bit more harder, but keep in mind, it's actually a little bit more better. Like, if you can get this one down, you can get anything down, basically. Get off your board, run, get on your skateboard, push, 
Ollie off, 540 tail walk, bam, and then cut right here. Ollie right there so you can land on this freaking slope right here and then just go down right here. So that's basically what it is, okay? Three, two, one, go, get off your skateboard, you run over here, you get on your skateboard, you push, you Ollie tail walk, 540, bam, cut right here, Ollie there, do another tail walk just like that, land right here, and then there you go. That's basically how to get pretty decent score on the ditch. If you can get that down, then you can get the rest of the run down, okay? But the, the right here is the very, the freaking most important. It's the freaking beginning. As soon as it says go, it's the most important uh, few seconds of your run. Okay, next up, we're gonna go over here to the freaking Mega Park. We're gonna go over here, where is it? Uh, Super Ultra Mega Park, teleport. Teleporting to the Mega Park. Okay, cool. All right, so as you guys know, we uh, start the game over here on this line, right about there. Uh, right about there. Okay, I, I think we do, or is it right here? Okay, I think we're just gonna do it right there. Bam. I like to go front, I like to go to the right, and something. sometimes, occasionally, I go back. So there's like kind of three runs for the Mega Park. You can go forward, which is basically following the path of the mega park all right here go over here go up here go down here go over here but as you get over here okay not not to the not to the pole right there be careful with that pole but as you get over here sometimes mo actually most of the time I don't like to come onto this ramp so basically this part of the freaking mega park is the most unused area of the mega park. You literally do not have to go on this ramp that I'm on right now. And usually you really, what the fuzzy bro? Where did you come from? Okay, and you don't need to go over there to those little, I don't even know what the hell you call those. Half pipes, I guess, I don't freaking know. Anyways, you're coming down this ramp. You're going like this, you're following it. Bam, just do up into here. And then right here, you cut off to the corner right here and transfer into the ramp right there not not exactly right there where i landed but you know you want to kind of hit it like right here so you can come into here and then go out here so i'm going to try to do it again for you guys you're coming down the ramp you're gonna ollie over this you're gonna go up right here and do not go over there to the other ramp you're gonna cut off right here in the corner and transfer right there bam and then right here just go into the ramp and do your stuff down there and continue following the path of the mega park that's round number one. Round number two is a little bit more difficult uh, because it requires for you to land this transfer. I personally, for some reason, can't, well, I can, but I don't know. Sometimes it's hard to, to transfer. I don't know, I, I don't know. I guess I played Mega Bar so much to the point where I'm already losing my skill in Mega Park because I'm just freaking tired of it. Anyways, three, two, one, go. We go off to the right, Ollie right here. Make sure you transfer to this little ramp and then BAM! Hit this and land it just like that. Cut off to the corner right there and transfer to the big ramp right here. Okay, I'm gonna do that one more time. We're gonna push, push, BAM! Right there and then BAM! To the transfer, land it and then go to the corner right here. Don't go straight up, go to the corner so that you can go in this direction that I just went in and so you can be able to go on this ramp and then do your stuff right there that's how you do round number two run number two not round round number three this one is for you people that are really good with uh trick spamming is what i like to call it other people have a different names like i don't know freaking popping four popping five popping six pop i literally do not know how many pops there is out there and i don't really care so yeah if you can pop you can pop pop lock and drop it but anyways as soon as it says three, two, one, go, get off your board and freaking go over here and then just, just begin doing this. Literally, just begin doing this over and freaking over again, okay? Literally, and if you lose speed, get off your board, push, and then bam, that's it. You literally do this for the whole, like, what, 60 seconds that you get or whatever the frick it is? And that's gonna give you pretty decent points. Only, of course, if you're good at doing these crazy trick spammings, one tricking, three tricking, five popping, six popping, three people popping, four popping, I don't know what the frick they're called these days. But yeah, that's round number three. And guys, honestly, the Mega Park um, is really easy to get points in. All you literally got to know is how to do what I said 
from the ditch, which is the tail walk. The tail walk is literally key, guys. The tail walk is like, in my opinion, the most key trick to learn to know to get really good points. You know, not ex you're not gonna get really, really, really high points with it, but it's definitely gonna get you more points than the average skater on skate three. And then after that, you can start doing some, you know, different kinds of variations to increase your score and stuff. So learn the tail walk, guys. Remember, analog stick up, B, bam, LT. Bam, 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 and hold it. That's how you do a tail walk. And literally, all you gotta do is tail walk 540s. That's it, tail, okay. If I go the round number one, which is straight down here, I can literally just do tail walks, just like this. Look, I can literally do that all my round, and I guarantee you, I'm gonna get a lot of points. Like, I guarantee you, I'll probably get more than 30,000 points to tell you the honest truth. I'll probably get like 40,000 points. If I just do a bunch of tail walks over and over every single time, I go off a ramp just like this. That's it. That's it. That's all the trick you gotta know. Nothing but tail walks. Um, it's kind of the cheap way to do it, but it's 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 a safe way. So like if you if you're like on the last round and you don't want to risk falling or something like that, then just do tail walks. Literally all tail walks. You can't go wrong with tail walks. They get you a lot of points. It's pretty freaking ridiculous. And then obviously right here, cut off. Freaking tail walk right there. If you don't get it, it's okay. If you fall, oh well, suck it up. <laughs> Anyways, um, this was a basic tutorial on how to get decent points on a Mega Park and the Ditch. If you guys enjoyed this video, smash that like button. I appreciate it when you do. Also, let me know in the comment section down below what other maps I should teach you guys how to get decent points on. Remember, this is not like an advanced tutorial, okay? This is just a basic tutorial giving you extremely easy and the easiest fastest basic ways to get really decent points okay so keep that in mind let me know the maps i should do next in the comment section down below i love you see you guys really soon remember my car's in the shop right now uh, if you guys didn't see the previous video check it out i'm doing a giveaway i'm gonna be making the video the reveal video for my car probably friday or saturday so stay tuned for that i love you guys peace out <laughs>